I'm Stephen Moore and I'm a land-based engineer for Hamilton Brothers in Bishopton. For day to day, it is servicing, repairs on-site and off-site. So back here at the workshop or I mean, you could be gearboxes, you could have brakes, you could have punctures. It's easy, some, some simple as a puncture, just to blow tire up, make sure it's, it's fixed. As I say, right down to the nitty gritty stuff, gearboxes, clutches, big stuff. Well, we work on tractors, forklifts, cranes, diggers, anything along the lines is, you know, we, we work on. Uh, I started off as a valor, then the same potential in me, sent me to college, became an engineer, and then field service engineer, so I got out of the van. That's kind of where I am today. A variety is good, the same as well, you're not working on the same type of machine. So we've got Massey Ferguson, we've got Valtra, and then we've got JCB. So it's different machines, different systems, different specs of tractors obviously have different systems in them. So you're not working on the exact same thing day in, day out. It's not a production line, it's, it is different. Whether if you're doing it here, whether if you're doing it, you know, you can travel anywhere in Scotland really. Well, you need to know your hydraulic systems, your electrical systems with and without can, which is a completely different system. It's a bigger, wider range. I mean, I know every car's got a different manufacturer. It's the same car, the same stuff in a car. There's no same stuff in tractors, really. There's a bit, yeah, there's a bit of difference there. Basically, I mean, you get a tractor that's broke, you know, gearbox or issues. You spend a week stripping it, another couple of days rebuilding it, and it works again. That's the, you know, it's back to its manufacturer spec. That's the kind of, then you look at it and you go, well, that was me done that. Job satisfaction right there, you know, shows that you can do it and you've done it and the best you can. Give it a go, a really good go, because I thought in the first couple of weeks I was washing tractors. You know, I was a baller, so I was washing tractors quite a lot. But then the more I get into kind of mechanical side, more I shown interest, um, the more they gave me. So basically, the harder I tried, the more I got. And that's what's led them to think, a good mechanic. So I would say basically give it a chance and work hard and you'll get what you're meant to get basically. I think just keep doing what I'm doing, still get better at the job, you learn stuff new every single day, training courses, you know stuff like that, just keep on top of manufacturers what we're doing and just see where it goes. Probably 70% of my knowledge is from my colleagues, you know, passing it on to me, showing me wee tricks of trade, how to do this, how to do that. And that's that's how you get better at what you do. You know, everybody helps everybody and that's that is how it works.